So this is a new uh, netbook from Asus, the EPC Flare, and this bit here is the flarey bit apparently. Anyway, that's not important. It's uh, obviously uh, built to a price rather than a, a spec, but it's Cedar Trail based, so you're getting the uh, full uh, HD video capabilities, and it's actually being demoed here with uh, HDMI out onto the screen here, so full 1080p hardware support. Um, chicken style keyboard, touchpad with the uh, mouse buttons. You know, the keyboard does feel a little bit, uh, little bit cheap, certainly compared to uh, the Ultrabooks that we've been seeing on the Intel booth here today. Let's have a look at the ports though. You do get a full set of ports. SD, two USB 2, sorry, USB 2, USB 3. This counts in a lot. There is an Ethernet port as well. He uh, combo headphone microphone on the other side. HDMI plus VGA and another USB 2 port. So a full complement of ports there which actually some Ultrabooks fail to achieve. Um, not sure what the pricing is going to be, but clearly it's going to be built to a, a, a sort of value price rather than being, um, you know, using high quality components. 10 inch uh, screen, I think that is 1024 by uh, 600. I've just turned it off and pretty much available in the next uh, few weeks, I'm told. Let's have a look. It's a hard, hard disk based system here, no SSD. Let's just bring up some of the uh, some of the specs there, and it's the uh, dual core N2800 at 1.86 gigahertz with two gigs of RAM, so a little bit more than your standard netbook. And actually, I think if Asus were to produce this with an SSD and 3G for a bargain price, it might actually attract some of the uh, Ultrabook. Uh, customers as well because for portability you've got a 6L battery there this is going to be a 9-10 hour device without any problems at all and with the 2 gigs the HDMI VGA and the, and the slightly higher clock rate on the CPU that's quite a nice proposition so there's the uh, Asus uh, EPC flare at the Intel booth CES 2012